and, and, and that is what that is what I really wanted to ask. Mm -hmm. You talked about you getting to this country with a thick accent and an African and getting on a job, getting promotion. Now, why is it that some of us from African background and even our children born in this country, in this abroad, some of them don't have the confidence. They have already played themselves down that because they are black, because they are coming from Africa, they cannot hold certain positions. They cannot run successful business. I think this is a bit of a challenge for us. What are you going to tell them? Okay, so let me tell them this. My missus is here with me. You know, she's a very strong woman, very um, agile and so on. But, God forbid, if we were to have a, 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 a skirmish just now, I expect me as a man to override her. Nothing wrong with her, but I could overcome her, right? Well, you know, blah, blah. Now, here's my point I'm trying to make. And I've been telling people this from the 80s. Listen to me carefully. <laughs> Listen to me carefully. If you are black, accept it that you have to work 10 times as hard. Wow. Just, just pay that price easy for yourself. Mm. That you're the one that's going to be on the showroom floor when everybody else is down the pub. Mm. Because you, they can pick on you. You're the one that will have to do that over time. It's just the fact of life. Mm. But when you sat in your, in my case, when you sat in your own source or your jet, it doesn't matter that you work 10 times as hard. You've got to the end. But to sit down trying to compare yourself to say, oh, well, he's white, so why must you get away with it? It's none of your business. Mm. <laughs> it's none of your business. You know, you're not going to sit down here asking yourself, well, why does Prince William have such an easy life and all of <laughs> Create your own life. <laughs> you know, create, you know, if I stand down, I've, got a, I've got a gymnasium downstairs in our basement, right? Okay, but look, I'm not built. Why am I not built heavy? Because I'm not willing to pay the price to be built heavy. Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm not willing, you know, every once in a while I go down there, jump on the bike, you know, maybe lift some dumbbells or whatever. I'm not willing to pay that price. But there are people out there in the world who are willing to pay the price. Yes. You know, and one of the things, um, one of the things that, that you can see that come uh, um, um, through is like in the area of sports. Mm -hmm. Okay, in the area of sports, you, you know, you could not stop Usain Bolt. Mm -hmm. there's, there's no, there's no, there's no racism there. Yeah. <laughs> you understand? Yeah. There's, a, there's no racism there. Why? Because he worked ten times as hard. Mm.